Hello guys and welcome back to another video of Alpha Neo Gaming and we're here back in Sparkling Zero. Last time you saw we completed Namek Saga and the Android Saga. So and I we also fought Cell. But we forgot to complete one scenario which was there and I saved it for this video. So we're gonna complete that scenario first and then we're gonna go on to the Majin Saga. Let's take a peek. Shall we listen? So let's go into the story. And I'm gonna go to the story map real quick. Go back a bit because there was a splitting path that I need to know what happened in there. Yeah, see there is one more place that we need to go. And I think this is the main story that we needed to go. And the last time we defeated Cell, like it ended a bit differently. Because that wasn't the real story, it was a what if scenario, so. Yeah, I'm just gonna go through it. Then he ended at Sword and we Check out my perfect form. And becomes it's perfect. So I defeated Cell with just Goku and that's why it ended with an alternate ending. So this time I'm not gonna defeat Cell because Gohan is the one who defeats Cell. So I just need to wear him down. The Cell games have officially begun. Now, if any of you should dare to step forward, I would like to kick things off. I'll go first. Well, well. I was hoping to save the best for last, Goku. But so be it. Come on! Inside! Too slow! Whoa. I'm not done yet. Get ready to see my real strength. Forget it. You Okay, so I did a lot of decent damage to Cell. Now I'm just gonna focus on defending myself and see if anything happens because I don't want to kill him. Like if I kill him, it will end with a different ending. So I'm just gonna block myself. Oh, I was right. So I just needed warm, uh, give up. warn his down. I fought as hard as I could, but it's pretty clear there's no the way I can this. beat you. So that's it for me. Truth is, I hate fighting, and I don't want to kill anyone. Believe it or not, I don't even want to kill a bad guy like you. Hmm. 
Now, my precious little babies, see those seven spectators up there? Kill them all! Oh, and do have fun. Guys, keep your guard up! These things are way stronger than they look! Damn it all! I, I'm sorry, guys. I messed up. I didn't think things would end up like this. Yeah! Okay, so I need to fight these side juniors. Ow. I'm not done yet. These are very tiny. Just like the anime. But they're strong. They're doing quite a decent amount of damage from their hits. The only issue I'm getting in this game, like, it's about the timing. Like, when they uh, counter attack, like, I usually don't get the time to like defend and also there is another technique in this game when you like quickly walk and hit an opponent I only saw that the CPU did it like a few times to me and I was like why am I not able to hit it so later on I'm thinking I'm gonna go through that battle training and I'm gonna try it out I try to do it, how you do I hit that? Because that was like you. really, really quick, and like I wasn't un unable to recover from that. Like, it would be a you huge advantage in a battle, like yourself, if you're now trying you're to take down your opponent and like he's suffering. vaulting you all around and you can't even spot where he is and he just takes you down. That is a technique that is worth learning, so. And. To be honest, my honest review on the revenge counter is like go I haven't on. used it much and I'm still able to go Finish through him. the game. It's all so up to you. it doesn't what, really you matter like if already? you're playing a ranked match or a <laughs> match against him off that another player. He deserves to feel the like, same pain he put all his mode, victims through. You will go through it. You will go through the game easy, but <laughs> The advanced techniques Am I are there, they are useful, I'm not saying 18? they're not, but without them you can get by easily. You, you, you but still, you need to work on the timings of dodging the attack and also dodging the opponent when they're using a super attack or an ultimate attack so that kind of matters a lot in this game because there are a few key moments where i was unable to defend myself from my ultimate attack and also the super attacks are easily dodgeable but when he goes into the sparkling state like that's when it gets harder like they're hitting you continuously and you're just looking for an opening to like dodge or like walk out of there so that is what i need to work on because that's my you know weakness in this game that us. i'm unable to dodge sometimes and they fault. take a lot of but life out of me him, even though i'm doing a lot of damage more than they did to me but still i need to like squeeze <laughs> in that extra life to like prevail in the game Look who's gonna give him this classical look when he's about to sacrifice everything. I I know that look. Sorry, yeah, everybody I knows thought that this look. over, guys. Well, any way you slice it, there's only one way to save Earth. Goodbye, my friends. Uh, goodbye? You're not thinking of Goku! No! You did good today, Gohan. Made me proud. Dad, what are you? Tell your mom I'm sorry. I'm not gonna make it home this time.
His... his energy... it's gone without a trace. short on options. Take care, okay? Live your lives to the fullest, and I'll see you again when you're dead! Bye-bye! Okay, so that wraps up our Cell Saga. Now we move on to the Majin Saga. Just let me double check if there's any splitting ends before I go forward. Yeah, there aren't any. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead with the Majin Buu Saga. Here it goes! What? We are going straight to the Majin Vegeta fight? Are we not gonna go into Babeli's ship and fight Yakon and anybody else? Wait, is there even Yakon in this game? You're telling me there is no Yakon? Uh, are we back at the tournament arena? Week? What's wrong with you? Oh, I was really hoping to like see those characters because that was the idea of playing the game because I needed to see those characters because they were in Buka 2, 3. I don't understand why they're not Vegeta! in this game, so that's a disappointment right there. And Yakon and Pui Pui are not there. Or maybe Pui Pui is, but I don't know about Yakon. Vegeta! Tell because me I it still isn't have true. to do the story mode with Bobby Vegeta, spell Gohan, take control and Piccolo, you? and because doing something Black like Goku, this would make me fight yeah. you. It's true, isn't it? If I hadn't gone to these links, we wouldn't be about to fight. He's all about I his one pride day, and one how he wants day in to which to beat you. Kakarot. And I wasn't going okay, to waste Goku. it standing around on that ship. That was your reasoning? You killed countless innocents to try and repair your meaningless pride? Meaningless? What do you know of meaningless? I don't give a damn about Majin Buu. All I want is my fight with Kakarot. Here and now, I will emerge as the victor once and for all. There's no reason he ever should have bested me. He and I are both Saiyans. But I was royalty among our people. I was a prince, yet he prevailed. He, he even had the impudence to save my life before. And that is an indignity I cannot bear. Poverty. Move us to some place where there's no one else around! I'll give Vegeta the fight he wants, but not here! <laughs> All right then, guess you can find somewhere else. For you to go this far, you must have wanted to settle the score real badly, huh, Vegeta? Can't lie, I get it. 
Starting up strong, eh? Now this, this is the type of fight that I always thought. like. It'll be over soon and enough. Equal when I kill you. That's it. Oh, he he's good. Oh, he's dodging my attacks quite easily. Yo. Yo. Wow. I can sense uh, he is making me struggle a bit. This Majin Buu creature must be really as powerful as the Supreme Kai was saying. I already told you. The only thing that matters to me is this battle. Everyone else can die. This is what I, I mean care. when I like, fail to defend myself sometimes. Deep down, I know your soul is still the same, Vegeta. But still, he hasn't hit at me that quickly, so I'm holding myself. Well, right now, this this is what I'm talking about. That quick wall and smash. I'm not done yet. I'm not done yet. Hmm, I'm not holding myself good. I'm missing a lot. He's giving me a very tough time. Apart from other characters, this character is quite fine. Resist. Let's take care of this boo first. You wouldn't give me your best in this fight if you were too distracted. Vegeta! Mm-hmm. So I got that triggered it. Alright, Majin Buu. Kill this guy first. Right now! Who here is first time? Come on, big guy. Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobbity? Nobody asked for your opinion. Majin Buu is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every command. If he knows what's good for him. Don't waste our time. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that. Ka -me -ka -me -ka! Let's do this already. I'm sorry this took so much longer than the others, but I haven't had as much practice with this one. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. 
I'm not done yet. Don't hold back. If I don't, who will? Dragon Fist! I consider it an honor. <laughs> okay. What are you waiting for, down. Majin Buu? Finish off this long-haired cretin already. We've got places to be. Mm-hmm. Wait, what? Oh man, did I trigger another what-if scenario? Ah, oh, shit. It's unbelievable. I didn't want to. I was Boo, going for the main storyline, but okay. life on a planet he once threatened? I never could have expected this outcome. Yeah, it's crazy, all right. But I'm really, really glad it worked out this way. It would have been such a shame for him to just die. Yeah, how do you figure? Well, Majin Buu was so strong that he could go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me, even in my Super Saiyan 3 form, right? Think of how great a rival he'd be for the next generation of fighters, like Gohan and Goten. Plus, most of my fiercest rivals are now some of my best friends. <laughs> I tell you, you might be the only guy in the whole universe who think a planet-destroying freak of nature would be a shame to let die. I'm serious, though. Honestly, I don't even think Boo would have been a bad guy to begin with if he wasn't manipulated by somebody as evil as Bobbity. <laughs> you may be right. Your track record shows you know how to bring out the good and even some of the worst people. <laughs> I just do what I do. With everything settled down now, it would have been really cool to fight Majin Buu at full power just one more time. But hey, maybe it'll happen someday. Okay, so I'm gonna do this one more time and I'm gonna go for Here it goes the main storyline. Now I know what do I need to do. So here it goes. Farewell, Boma. Drop. Margin Boo, kill this guy first. Right now! Who oh, here you first time! Come on, big guy! Why is somebody as strong as you taking orders from a shrimp like Bobby? Nobody asked for your opinion. Martin Boo is my loyal servant, and he obeys my every command. If he knows what's good for him. Alright, let's go! <laughs> Don't waste our time. Vegeta already tried the golden hair trick, and look what happened to him. Hold on. There's regular old Super Saiyan. Then there's a level beyond Super Saiyan. But further beyond that... Do this already. I'm sorry this took so much longer than the others, but I haven't had as much practice with this one. This is what I call Super Saiyan 3. I'm not done yet. Don't hold back. Yeah. 
Trunks is on the move. Hopefully that means he found the Dragon Radar and is leaving West City. Ah, uh, that should trigger it. Because it's a different dialogue and boost to life though. That's the same. Oh, okay. Now, now we're going the right way. Goku, I'm sorry, but it's about time we took you back to Otherworld. Right. I understand. Uh, uh, um... What's the matter, Goten? Uh... Goten, honey. Do you want to give your dad a hug before he goes? Oh, was that all? You should have said so, son. Bring it in. Goten, you take good care of your mom for me, okay? <laughs> well, that's it, everybody. I'll see you all on the other side. So I guess it's directly on to Super Blue. Ha ha! I finally found you! V Vegeta! The earring! Give it here! We're gonna see Vegito. Vegeta! Let's do this! Hand it to me, now! All right! I'm Vegeta and Kakarot together! Guess that makes me Vegeta! And this, get ready for this! Is Super Vegito! Take this! No! Whoa, these strikes are fast. Whoa. This has to be my favorite character now. Look at how fast he is. Don't be such a baby about it. If it means anything, even I'm surprised at how easily I'm kicking your face in. Kamehameha! Just about enough fun for one day. So I'm going to give you ten seconds to say your prayers before I wrap this up. This is bullcrap! <laughs> you aren't much at all! Alright, let's hope this plan's crazy enough to work.
Your strength is truly amazing, Kangaroon. You've always been like this, ever since the day I first met you. You were prepared to meet a challenge, even when it was bigger than you were. First, I thought it was your loved ones. That it was your blind instinct to protect them that spurred you on and pushed you beyond your limits. And certainly that was part of it. But over the years, I realized there was more. Something else in the way you approach it. path. I used to fight for the sheer pleasure of it. Sparing no one, I killed the dominant to feed my insatiable pride. But you never fight to kill. Or even to win, only to test your limits and become the strongest you could possibly be. You showed mercy to everyone, even me. As if you knew one day I would possess the tiniest sliver of a sword. And here I am, fighting alongside of you. To defy all logic. By some miracle, your compassion has rubbed off on me. And yet I still don't fully understand how you do it. How can a Saiyan fight with such power? And at the same time, be so gentle. Perhaps it's my anger that made me blind to the truth of so long. Hang on there, Kekaro. You are number one. A real fight starts now! Get ready to see the real story. Kakarot, you can finish him off on your own. Just charge your energy all the way and vaporize this monster. What do you think I've been trying to do? I just haven't had a chance to concentrate. I can't focus my power. It's just so hard when he keeps coming at me. I only need a minute. One minute, that's all. Fine. Then I'll make my stand against him for the next minute. And while he's occupied, you power up! Supreme Kai's and Dende! Do you hear me up there? If you can, then say something, damn it! Vegeta! I think it's about time we let the people of Earth shoulder the burden for once. The plan is underway. It's time for you to create a spirit bomb. But even if I collect a little energy from all the people who were brought back, it still won't be enough to take down Boo. It won't just be a little bit. You'll get every ounce of spirit energy they can spare! <laughs> if you really want to use the spirit bomb, Vegeta, and since I've got it to go through, I kind of feel like a proud dad! Okay, guys, it's all set! And you can speak not to just Earthlings, but the whole universe if you want! That's more like it! Citizens of planet Earth, can you hear me? I like this new side of you, Vegeta. Nice going! Here we go! People of Earth, give me your energy! Incredible warrior, Boo. It was you against the universe, and you nearly won. I hope you can come back once more, but good. I want to fight you again, one on one, without all the loss. I'll be right there waiting for you, only stronger. Later. You can stay now? We can all be together like a real family? You and Gohan and Goten are back and there's no catch? That's right! I can't wait to get to Mount Pauzu and have some of your good old home cooking, Chi-Chi. Oh, come on, Chi-Chi, why are you crying? I thought it was good news.
Okay, so I checked. There is no splitting end here. So I'm just gonna go with the guard of destruction saga, you know. Just double checking. Yep, there is no splitting end, so. Just an alternate ending, that's it. Okay, I also want to check like how many characters I can play the story with. Thank you, Vegeta, Gohan. I see Piccolo, Frieza, and Goku Black. Okay. So I'm gonna do Vegeta next after Goku. But right now, we're gonna play the God of Destruction arc and the Frieza Resurrection arc. So continue okay. the Let's do this thing story. I hope there's no spreading hands in there. But I know there are gonna be some. Okay. Let's go, Lord Beerus, you and me! But if I win, you have to leave this planet untouched, deal? Very well, I accept your terms. But know this, none in this universe can hope to match the power of Beerus the Destroyer. I'm not done yet! There should be another fight, you know, at King with viewers before this one huh? did the super saiyan god thing work i don't know it sure seemed like it did but i can't sense my dad's energy at all believe it or not that's good news the energy that radiates from a god cannot be detected by mere mortals i'm not done yet Finally, this is what I've been waiting for. <laughs> what do you say we continue this fight on equal footing, God to God? Sounds good to me. I'm only scratching the surface of this new power. I'm going all out. But what about you, Beerus? I can tell you're holding something back. Figured that out, did you? <laughs> well, I had a feeling, but you don't have to hold yourself back for my sake, Lord Beerus. I'm not gonna get any stronger unless you face me with everything you've got. Are you always this talkative? You just don't get it.
Vegeta, sorry, but I've gotta run. Ugh, fine. Do whatever you want, as usual. It occurs to me. I suppose I should thank you. Thank me? What in the world for? For years, my every step, my every breath has been motivated by a single desire. Revenge. My new power, strength enough to hold the universe by its throat. It was you who gave it to me. Losing to you, to a pathetic Saiyan. It consumed me. The humiliation was too much to bear. Enough! Get to the point! Ah, impatient as ever. Very well. As a token of my gratitude, I will destroy you first. I knew it! You've been holding something back, haven't you? That's well deduced for a simpleton. I've held back just like you. Then let's both go all in. No tricks, no reserves. All right, now it's your turn. Let's see this new power of yours. Care to cut to the chase, do we? Very well, then I won't hold anything back either. Brace yourself! Behold my newfound evolution! I know gold's a bit gauche, but I wanted to ensure you grasp my new position atop the pecking order. And for the sake of your feeble mind, let's keep the name simple. <laughs> you fools! You... you fools! It's over, Frieza! Once and for all! I couldn't have put it better myself! Okay, wait. So it's universe six versus seven arc, I guess. Wait, no. They're skipping the whole universe six versus seven arc. Why, bro? Sorry, I okay, swung I at you without any warning, Goku. For a second there, I thought you were bad. someone else. To hit. Nah, you were just rattled. Don't worry about it. So tell us, so who is this guy? Over to Would you believe me if I said he called himself Goku? The Goku Blackheart. What? Directly. Me? Okay. He I wears see. dark clothes instead of your orange ones, so we started calling him Goku Black. I'll never forget the day he showed up. He said he was going to exterminate the human race. He said he was doing it in the name of justice. I struggled against him for a year after that. But by that point, there were hardly any survivors left on Earth. Then, he tracked down Mom just before I came here. Wait a sec. My future self also wrote a message specifically for me. She wanted us to fix the machine and return with you. That means she wants me to go there and beat Kakarot myself! Come on, Vegeta, it's not me! It must be someone who just looks like me! Hey, Trunks, help me gauge how strong this guy is! Fight me for a while so you can compare my strength to his. Sure. Jumping to C 
Super Saiyan 2 right off the bat, huh? Sounds good to me. I figured this out after you left. I call it Super Saiyan 3. That's incredible. I wouldn't expect anything less from you. In that case, I'll show you my strongest move. All right, attack me with everything you've got. <laughs> Goku Black! Oh, now I see. No wonder I couldn't find you. Hmm. Goku? And the Destroyer Beerus. Wow! You really do look alike, huh? How are you, Goku? You're looking quite well. So, we're about to watch Goku vs. Goku. It's shaping up to be a fascinating day. Not bad. But you're a whole lot stronger than that, right? <laughs> I'm flattered you rate me so highly. But I'm getting too much out of this to ride. It's time to win. It's time to win. Excellent, Goku. You can hurt me as much as you want. The pain will only make me stronger. Uh, okay. That's a pretty creepy thing to say. Here we go! Yeah. Retribution! Kamehame! Ah! Admit to be here! Have some of this! and space-time must be dissipating. It's going back to normal. Would be your utmost pleasure to please engage in fisticuffs with me, your kindness, sir. All right, let's give it a go. You know, I haven't fought a god since Lord Beerus. You fought a destroyer? I'm not done yet. Here we go. No, no. Some of this. Did you feel that? Indeed. Wait, is that Black's energy? No, but it was awfully close. I'm going all out! Pitiful. Here it goes! Yeah! 
You know, for just a plain old Kai, you're pretty strong. Between the antisocial psyche that's clearly lurking within him and the energy that he's projected outward, I'd say our suspicions that Zamasu is black have been circumstantially corroborated. Then maybe I should just dispense with him now while I can. Hmm? You guys sure about this? You know, he really didn't seem like such a bad guy to me. That's because you're too trusting of people. The energy I felt was similar, but it wasn't exactly the same as Black's. It seems there are more mysteries to solve. If you do anything that Grand Zeno finds insulting, he could easily erase you, me, this entire reality from existence. Don't forget that. One more thing, Whis. If Grand Zeno does lash out, make sure it's not its Supreme Kai. I need him protected at all costs. What's up? I mean, good day and greetings. So what's going on with you? What do you want? I'm not asking much. I just want a friend, you see. You're not like most people. You're fun. I want you to be my friend, Ogie Dogi. We can do that, I guess. But is that the only reason you called? Is that a problem? Of course not, Grand Zeno. Goku would feel privileged to be your friend and provide you unsurpassed joy. You be quiet. I'm sorry, Zeno, but actually now's a bad time. There's something I've got to take care of, but when it's done, we can play, I swear! So once you're done with your busy thing, you'll play with me? Sure! And if you want, I can bring somebody else who'd be even more fun to play with, too. So the next time, you won't have to wait on me. Really? Okay, it's a date! Go on, Goku! Rejoice! Only through me will you finally reach the pinnacle of beauty you have sought for so very long. You know, I don't know what you're rambling on about. Father! Your mind is too small. Your kind is incapable of understanding the grandeur of my success and the glory of my cause. It's like staring into the sun. You cannot see. The vast beauty of my being overwhelms you. For I am a breed apart and divine. <laughs> I've been keeping this one a secret. Here I come. Break through the limit. Me, me. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Your mind is too small. Your kind is incapable of understanding the grandeur of my success and the glory of your cause. It's like staring into the sun. You cannot see. The vast beauty of my being overwhelms you. For I am a breed apart and divine. Here I come! Taste my blade! Magnificent! The body of a saint is like this right. Your mind is too small. Your kind is incapable of understanding the grandeur of my success and the glory of my cause. It's like staring into the sun. You cannot see. The vast beauty of my being overwhelms you. For I am a breed apart and divine. <laughs> That's enough. Samasu! I thought you were decent, but you're scheming with black! Scheming? Such a negative word. We are more like comrades on a righteous crusade. So we. Here it goes! Take this! I'm going all out! 
My wait is almost over. Soon the world I've been dreaming of for so long will be made manifest. A truly just and perfect utopian existence. Mortals are unnecessary. And more than that, unwelcome in my paradise. Hate to burst your bubble, but there's no way I'm letting you two get what you want! Goku, this time I'll fight! No, no. This should be planted sufficient. So we for a pure and beautiful world. You will fall. Evil <laughs> shall no longer exist. I am Everyone, lend me your power. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! This should be planted sufficient. Everyone, lend me your power! Final flash! How disappointing you ungrateful and barbaric creatures are! The gods gave you minds capable of true wisdom, yet you wasted on self-interest and war. How can you talk about the values of mortals after everything you've done to my- Final Flash! You think you got him? What? It can't be! I've taken godhood to a new level. Divinity made perfect. With a body that befits a Kai. One that is invincible. I can already tell I'm going to be sleeping soundly tonight. This is your end. A Saiyan? Who's there? It seems we've returned to a future where there is no black. My world didn't change. I knew it. Beerus couldn't fix this. Not even the act of a god made a difference. We know the truth! All the terrible things you've done! We know you use the Super Dragon Balls to get your power! You think I'm a copy? Oh, you're wrong. This is Goku's actual body, down to the last battle scar. The perfect war machine. I took the Time Ring and found the Super Dragon Balls. Then, with my first wish to the dragon, I switched bodies with you, Goku. Okay, so if you're telling us you're Zamasu, then who's this guy who actually looks like him? From your world's perspective, I'm the Zamasu from this world. And I work for justice with the Zamasu from the past. You haven't worked it out yet, Goku? I'm none other than the Kai once called Zamasu. The god defeated by a mere mortal. But how can that be? 
I saw Beerus destroy you. He said you'd be gone. Old Beerus clearly doesn't understand the full beauty of this time ring. Wearing it protects me. Not even what a god did in the past can affect me. Thanks to the time ring, I could empower my new ally without waiting at all. We collected the Super Dragon Balls in the future and wished again. You were willing to kill your Supreme Kai just to get that ring? Yes. Then we had to make sure no one would undo our accomplishments later. So we found the Super Dragon Balls once more and shattered them. After that, we had to keep the other gods from interfering here. I used your strength to kill every other Kai in this multiverse. That means in this timeline, there are no more gods who can stop us. We have all the power. The, the two, two of us, us alone. alone! This destruction was unfortunate, but necessary to achieve our virtuous goal. The Zero Mortal Plan. Mortals are a foolish and ugly mistake that stain the majesty of the cosmos. By eliminating all mortal creatures, we can reclaim this perfect creation. We've already cleansed a great number of planets of their repulsive mortal blight. Your filthy kind is worst of all. How many times have conflicts nearly destroyed this planet and threatened to spread across the universe? Because you are the ugliest, we are sentencing you to the heaviest punishment. A despair and terror that befits your wicked crimes. And none of you will escape it. This is it, Saiyans. For the sake of our most glorious project, you will die to death. Sure, you would have asked by now, Goku. Aren't you concerned about your family? My family? I've been keeping this one a secret. Where does it not begin such a gripping tale? After I collected the Super Dragon Balls and switched bodies with you, I went to Earth to check to make sure we had really switched. And there I found you. You were shocked to find yourself in my body. Family is terrifying. Damn you! What about Chi-Chi? And Goten! Ka me! Ka me! Ka! <laughs> oh, surely you can guess that much, Goku. You monster! You pay for that! You took my body! You took my life! And then you even killed Chi-Chi and Goten! You're gonna regret telling me that, Zamasu! No, I'm mad! Thank you, Goku. Your anger feels good.
There will be no more retreating. Now you're trapped here. So this world will be the last you ever see. For a god, you're surprisingly confused. This isn't going to be our final resting place, it's going to be yours! We were even going to bring you a casket, but we couldn't find one small enough. Our master Goasu and the other Kais were foolish enough to believe mortals could be entrusted with intellect. So, Kakarot, where are you keeping that jar? Oh, crap! It was still in the time machine when they blew it up! How can you be that stupid? Fine. What's done is done. I'd rather win with our fist than some magic trick anyway. <laughs> I was just thinking the same thing. Keep your focus on me! Mortals do not tell God what to do! Do not keep up with me! I won't lose! Here we go! No, no. Here it goes! This is just the start. Channel my divine rage into power. I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you. This sound will carve a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine wrath. <laughs> just as we foresaw, fighting this formidable Saiyan blight has carried us both to new heights. This proves our transformative power. Our destiny is to cast judgment upon all creation. Hold it! Yes. <laughs> What's the matter, mortals? Relax. Don't be afraid. I thought you Saiyans loved fighting the strongest. You I'm not done yet. Right. Here I come! Taste my blade! Magnificent. The body of a sailor is the ultimate and divine blessing. Here we go! I'm not done yet. Father! Goku! Trunks, you okay? He's weak. Trunks must have done something. You pathetic, lowly mortals. Ta me! Ta me! Kneel before our radiance! This game is over. You shall kneel before our radiance. Justice together! Thus begins a new world. Show your reverence and bow down before our splendor. Worship me. Give praise unto me. Me the beautiful, the sublime. Me the invincible, the almighty and divine. All hail, son. Keep Bulma safe! Right! Goku, Vegeta, are you all right? Yeah, we're a little banged up. But I think we're okay, at least for now. After fusing, he now possesses indestructibility and Saiyan strength. Uh, Goku, how can he surpass that? Who knows? But no matter what, I will make him pay for everything he's done. With you all the way, Vegeta. I don't care about the odds. We won't stop until he's defeated! No hard feelings! This cannot be!
What? Oh man, I don't know why I do this like I trigger the alternate ending first. Even last time I did it. Oh, there are three splitting ends. Okay. So I'm gonna try the first one first. Then I'm gonna go to the other one. There are two splitting ends together, so. And there's no other splitting end. Yeah, just making sure. Mm-hmm. The truth about Zamasu, okay. Hmm. We know the truth. Mortals, we've already cleansed a great number. Cannot keep up with me. Here we go. No, no. Sure, you would have asked by now, Goku. Aren't you concerned about your family? My family? <laughs> Mike, Where does Rudy get such a gripping tale? After I collected the Super Dragon Balls and switched bodies with him, I went to Earth to check to make sure we had really switched. And there I found him. You were shocked to find yourself in my body. Your family was terrified. Damn you! What about Chi-Chi? And Goten! Oh, sure, you can guess that much. Now oh, you're a monster! You'll pay for that! You took my body! You took my life! And then you even killed Chi-Chi and Goten! You can regret telling me that, Zamasu! Now I'm mad! Now I'm really, really mad! And now it's time to pay! Where did you go? What? That's impossible! How how could this happen? This is for Chi Chi and Goten! I again triggered an alternate ending. Damn it. Oh well. Looks like I have to do it again. Here it goes! Oh. 
There will be no more retreating. Yeah. You better keep your focus on me! Yeah. Mortals do not tell gods what to do! What? <laughs> Here we go! This is just the start. We channel my divine rage into power. I have forged a new instrument with which to destroy you. This side will carve a reminder into your mortal flesh of the strength of my divine wrath! <laughs> Just as we foresaw, fighting this formidable Saiyan Blight has carried us both to new heights. This proves our transformative power. Our destiny is to cast judgment upon all creation. Mikey, hold it! Foolish! <laughs> What's the matter, mortals? Relax! Don't be afraid. I thought you Saiyans loved fighting the strongest. Father! Goku! Trunks, you okay? He's weak. Trunks must have done something. How did you disgrace yourself against those more you pathetic, lowly mortals? Heal before our radiance! This game is over. You shall kneel before our radiance. Justice together! Thus begins a new world. Break through the limit! Ka me! Ka me! Ka! Show your reverence and bow down before our splendor. Worship me. Give praise unto me, me the beautiful, the sublime, me the invincible, the almighty the divine. All hail, Sarmas. Trumps, keep Bulma safe! Right! Prepare yourself! It's a great honor to fall at the hands of a god, is it not? Eat it! Goku, Vegeta, are you all right? Yeah, we're a little banged up. But I think we're okay, at least for now. After fusing, he now possesses indestructibility and Saiyan strength. How can you surpass that? Who knows? But no matter what, I will make him pay for everything he's done. With you all the way, Vegeta. I don't care about the odds. We won't stop until he's defeated. Oh, now you're in discretion with your life! <laughs> this isn't... <laughs> Hearken unto me. I am the brightly glowing sun in the sky which illuminates this world. And all shall know that my brilliance is justice. I, the god Zamasu, am the universal wisdom, the universal law, and yes, the universal power. I'm not done yet. Okay, we finally triggered it. The right way. a shield for this world and for all of us mortals Galagon! come on trunks give it all you've mm -hmm. got right i've had enough of you impudent mortals away with you samasu get ready because i'm knocking your lights out for good Shall smite the heart of the wicked. 
face my divine wrath! Blasphemous fool! You continue to defy a god! Half of this combined Zamasu came from Black. It seems the part of his body that's vulnerable to attacks is affecting the part that isn't. Okay, Vegeta. It's time. We're gonna fuse. Just like them. Don't... You can't be serious, clown! There's no way I'm going to do that again! I don't like this any more than you do, Vegeta. But if we still need a major boost in power to break down his body, then this is the best chance we've got! Come on! You gotta admit I'm right about this! <laughs> Good luck, you two. Thank you. It's now or never, Vegeta. There's something I've always wondered. When we fused last time, the Kai said it was permanent. But we split apart anyway. Do you know why? The truth is, it's only permanent if a Supreme Kai is involved. Otherwise, it only lasts an hour. So just a one-hour battle, then we're back to ourselves! Cut it out! If you say one more word, then the answer's no! Damn it all! One hour, but that's it! Vegeta, I need your help. Just one more time! So oh, I swore I'd never merge bodies with you again! Who are you? You two doubled up, so we did the same. You know, just to play fair. We're a merged fight. A combination of Vegeta and Kakarot. Vegeta! And here's something new. Vegeta Blue! Playtime is over. Get ready for this. Be more powerful. But you're still not a god! Okay, what do you say we wrap this up? No, no. Take this! No! Oh, I'm sorry, is this hurting you? You aren't a purely invincible god anymore. And you can never get the number of mortals down to zero now. You see, now that you've merged, you've taken in something that's always going to be a part of you for as long as you live. Goku's mortal and destructible body. You think that's a revelation? That Goku's body will always be a part of me? Of course you will. Such was my desire. You are mortal, Saiyan. Yet you've gained divine power. You're stronger than most deities now. Saiyans are the ultimate symbol of the failure of the Kai's. By taking Goku's flesh into my being, I have assumed both the sins of mortal kind and the failure of divinity, so they may never be repeated. Got an answer for everything, huh?
Hmm? It hasn't been an hour yet. It's not about gods and mortals. You don't believe in anything but yourself. And we won't let you win! I can feel it. Keep it coming, guys. Share your power with me! Supreme Kai, tell me. Do you think the Zeno of this timeline is still around? Yes, there's no question. Of course he would be. No one can defeat Grand Zeno. It's impossible. All of existence, go away! Okay, so I guess we're finished with the Google Black arc. So I can gladly say we can move on to the tournament arc afterwards. So, I'm gonna say I'm gonna end the video right here. And I'm gonna be back with another Dragon Ball Sparkling Zero video for you guys. And we're gonna do the tournament of power in the next video. So, till then, take care and goodbye guys. I'll see you guys in the next video.